This year's original mountain marathon in England turned into more of a crawl than a race. Severe weather in England's Lake District forced hundreds of mountain runners to spend Saturday night in tents and hastily organized shelters. By Sunday afternoon, British authorities were able to account for all the participants. Um, I think that's about as bad as I've seen them. I, I've been doing these for about 25 years now, and I think that's probably the worst. About 2,500 athletes began the race Saturday morning before it was stopped around midday. Competitors were scattered across the 50-mile course over mountains as high as 7,054 feet when heavy rain and high winds rolled in. Almost 800 people were stranded, spending the night in barns, a school, and other shelters. About 1,700 camped out in the hills. About a dozen people had to be treated for minor injuries and mild hypothermia. Yes, we appreciate that. It's a tough event. And walkers going out on the hill on a normal Saturday and Sunday sometimes get injured. And these things happen. We have a procedure in place and that kicked in quite well. Racers say the event is billed as a rough event, so competitors know what they're getting into. The area near the race had about two and a half inches of rain in 24 hours. The annual race is held at this time of year because making it through the strong wind and heavy rain is part of passing the test. Um, with hindsight, of course, then probably it would have been a better move to not, not go ahead, but they weren't to know it would be quite as bad as it was. It was the first time in the race's 41-year history that the event had to be cancelled. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.